Hi there, thanks for joining us. I'm Chris McKinnon with the WBZ News Update for you. We are following breaking news this afternoon. Several schools in Situate are on lockdown as police deal with a standoff situation in the woods along Route 3. Officials tell WBZ the suspect has threatened to hurt police. We do have crews on the scene and we'll continue to bring you updates on air and online right here at CBSBoston.com. The Somerville police officer injured in a motorcycle crash has died. Officer Louis Remigio passed away last night. He was a 30 year veteran of the force. Police say Remigio was hit by 18 year old Michael Ricci, who was drag racing on 95 in New Hampshire on Sunday morning. Ricci is free on bail and due back in court later on this month. A 13 year old is under arrest, accused of shooting a 12 year old Taunton boy with his mother's rifle. Police say the shooting may have been a result of cyberbullying. The suspect's mother says her son has been tormented and threatened for years. The victim is at a Rhode Island hospital recovering. From the gunshot wound. Now let's check in with meteorologist Danielle Niles and a check of our forecast. It feels like summer out there, Danielle. And looks like fall. Isn't it crazy, Chris? We've got the colors popping across New England, yet we're up around 80 degrees. A reinforcing shot of cooler air is coming in tonight, though, with a few passing clouds, high pressure nosing its way out of eastern Canada. Tomorrow will feature temperatures in the 60s, thickening clouds, maybe a shower by the evening, but a lot of the activity stays suppressed just to our south and west as that drier air works its way in. So Thursday, nice crisp fall air mass, mostly sunny skies, wind Wind off the ocean the next couple of days and cooler temperatures kind of ticking it down by a couple notches through Thursday. Partly cloudy tonight, air out the house. Let the fresh air in. 50s in the suburbs, 60 in downtown Boston. Kids at the bus stop tomorrow, 50s out of the gate, 60s by recess and topping out in the mid to upper 60s for many of us for highs tomorrow. And believe it or not, this is actually a little bit above where we should be, topping 65 to 70 for most of us on our Wednesday afternoon. Thursday, a little cooler, low 60s. Friday, bright sunshine, mid 60s to end the week. And then the warmth comes. Right back on in. It looks mainly dry this weekend, but we do turn a little bit humid again, Chris, on Saturday and Sunday. Maybe a shower on the Cape on Saturday afternoon. All right, Daniel, thank you very much. And thanks for checking in with us. I'm Chris McKinnon. This has been a WBZ News Update. Have a great day.